Hello everyone, today's video, we will do a recap of what is machine learning. The new topic of discussion will be an example of supervised learning scenario. Next we will understand the definition of supervised learning, classification versus regression model, list of classification algorithms, list of regression algorithms and finally how to choose algorithms for your project. Machine learning is a subset of artificial intelligence, which works based on self-learning algorithms using the past experiences or data set without being explicitly programmed. Types of machine learning techniques, what are they? There are primarily three types of machine learning, supervised, unsupervised, and reinforcement learning. What is supervised learning? Using this example, let's try and understand what exactly is supervised learning. There are totally 1097 species of vegetable recorded till date by the Biodiversity International Scientists. Out of this, we have picked three most common species of vegetables, that is, tomato, bell pepper, and carrot. Next, we have labeled the data and specified its characteristics, features, and attributes, and created a data set. For example, for each vegetable, we have specified the colors that it would be available, the shape, size, the taste, if seeds available or not, region that it is grown, and much more information required to input the data. Once we have all the data ready, we start to label them based on the features and attributes and we are exactly aware of the information being fed and this is happening in a supervised manner. And this is why it is called supervised learning. The more data it analyzes, the better it becomes at making accurate predictions without being explicitly programmed to do so, just like humans would. This training data is also known as input data. The data classification or predictions produced by the algorithm are called outputs. The two main types of supervised learning are classification and regression. They are distinguished by the target variable types. Let's do a quick comparison between classification and regression. The most significant difference between regression versus classification is that while regression helps predict a continuous quantity, Classification predicts discrete class labels. Now, let's talk about classification data. In classification problems, the output values of target class are discrete. Target value must be belonging to a class. In this example, target values are fruit names which depends on color, diameter, and white. In classification, we classify our data into classes, then can predict class for new data. This is how classification data looks like. In regression problems the output values of target class are continuous. Target value must be integer or float. In this example target value of house price is an integer value depends on bedrooms in house, floors, condition and location. So, our model will predict an integer value of house price by using these features. So, this is how our regression data looks like. Okay. But how our data looks like in graph? For regression problem suppose you have only one feature x and target value y, and you are going to plot and graph for x equal to 1 y also 1, for 3 y equal to 5, and that's going on. We can draw a line or curve for predicting new data. But what's the strategies and maths behind this line? If you know comment below. If you don't know. Worries not. Soon I will make videos about this topic. So, subscribe my channel and click bell icon. But in classification problem we will separate our data and make classes, and our data should looks like this. In this example based on values of x we make clusters for fruits. Target classes cloud be two or more than two. Some of the classification and regression model algorithms are listed here. Understanding the differences between regression versus classification algorithms is crucial for data scientists to solve market issues effectively. Accurate data predictions rely heavily on selecting the right models, ensuring high precision in the results. Selecting the right machine learning algorithm for a real-world problem involves understanding the problem, the data, and the algorithm's strengths and weaknesses. 
Here's a simplified step-by-step -step guide with real-world examples and use cases. Step 1. Define your problem. Start by clearly defining your problem. What are you trying to predict or solve? For example, predicting whether an email is spam or not. Step 2. Gather and prepare data. Collect and prepare your data. Make sure it's clean and relevant to your problem. For example, a data set with thousands of emails labeled as spam or not spam. Step 3. Choose an algorithm category. Machine learning algorithms can be categorized into three main types, supervised or unsupervised, or reinforcement learning. Step 4. Select specific algorithms. Now, within your chosen category, you'll need to select a specific algorithm. Here are some common ones with examples. For supervised learning algorithms, logistic regression or random forest. For unsupervised learning algorithms, K means clustering or PCA could be applicable. Similarly, for reinforcement learning algorithms, Q learning could be applicable. Step 5. Evaluate and compare. Now you need to evaluate and compare your selected algorithms using metrics like accuracy, precision, recall, or F1 score. Choose the one that performs the best on your data. Step 6. Fine-tune and optimize. You will now fine-tune your chosen algorithm by adjusting hyperparameters. This process may require experimentation. Step 7. Implement and monitor. Once you've selected your algorithm and fine-tuned it, implement it in your application. Continuously monitor its performance and retrain as needed with new data. So, we come to an end of this session and theoretically understood the concepts of supervised learning and the difference between classification and regression models. In the upcoming video, we will discuss about unsupervised learning. Thank you for watching the video. Please like, share, subscribe and comment.